Well, Jaden, given the um, the medical situation for uh, for John Fleck, how much did that win feel like one for him? Yeah, definitely, it was massive. Um, it's, it's horrible whenever something like that happens on the pitch. And the main thing about tonight is that he's OK um, and he's stable. So, so yeah, definitely it was a massive, massive result for Flecky. When you're out there and in, in the thick of it, given what's happened at, even in this year at the, at, the, at the Euros, do you fear the worst? Yeah, definitely. Um, especially when it happens so quickly. You don't expect it. Obviously, you just expect to play a normal football match. You don't really think about them things going into games. but. But they can happen and, and it's happened today. But the main thing, as I said, is that Flecky's OK and, and he's stable. And yeah, the win was, was definitely in, for him. In seeing the game through, how much does it then become? And look, even for the Reading players, I suppose, because you're all in the same boat, aren't you? Thinking about a teammate when you've got 20 odd minutes plus of a game still to play. Yeah, definitely. You just have to try and switch your focus back onto the game. It's hard because obviously you don't want something like that to happen. Um, but yeah, you just got to try and focus on the game and, and being 1 0 up. To try and finish the game, especially for him. Uh, the team, obviously, prior to today, had failed to win their last four. So, how important was it that you were able to get over the line today? Yeah, massive. It's a, it's a turning point for us. We need to push forward now, and we looked a lot more solid defensively. Um, we created a few chances as well. Um, so, yeah, it has to be a turning point for us because we haven't been haven't been quite as good so far. But but now we need to really turn it on. And how do you sustain that? Even in even in matches recently, Sheffield United have had periods of games for however long where the possession with pace and, and, and effectiveness has been great. But it's sustaining that. How, how do you do that? And why why don't you do that on a regular basis? Um, it's tough. The championships are a very tough league. Um, and there's going to be some days where where the opposition are are on top, there'll be some games when you're on top, but I think we just need to, to try and focus on dominating games, focus on putting teams under pressure, being defensively solid and then creating chances, and then when we get them chances, putting them away, and we've done that today, so, so yeah, it's, it's a positive result. You mentioned about being defensively solid today. Has, has anything changed or been worked on or said in the last couple of games that's enabled you to get to that? Because Coventry didn't have a great deal either tonight, you look very solid for the most part throughout. Yeah, just go back to basics, defend 1v1 jewels, being strong, marking in the box, being organised as a team, um, all of them things, just, just putting them together for 90 minutes and, and doing that and then and then going forward, focus on that as well. But <clears throat> our priority is to, to keep clean sheets and we've done that again tonight. And for you, nice to get the goal, tidy finish too as well from a, well, quite a tight <laughs> angle. Yeah, definitely, I should have, should have scored the one before, but um, yeah, it's positive, positive for me um, but yeah again it's about the team tonight and especially for Flecky. How are you assessing your own contribution then right now? Yeah I'm just just enjoying playing um, and enjoying getting results I think today was a massive one and it's about the team at the moment um, not about individuals so, so yeah I'm enjoying my football but ultimately it's about winning games and getting three points.